Hello guys, my name is Disha and today I have bought for you these very very beautiful uh, pattern inspired nails which I am also uh, doing for the ILL weekly nail challenge. So this is a, the, this is my complete design that I have already done on my left hand and today I will be showing you how I work with my non-dominant hand that is uh, my left hand onto my right hand. I've already done these two fingers, but thumb is left for you guys. So I will be showing you the polishes. The first and the black polish that I'm using is this one by Revlon Color Stay. It is 270 Stilettos is the name. And what I've done is that I've painted my pointer finger and my pinky finger with this black polish. And the white I'm using is this one by Flormar. And I've painted my middle finger, ring finger and thumb with white polish okay so now i have my black acrylic paint out in my plate and i will be painting for you my thumb now keep to keep your non-dominant hand as still and as light on your table as possible i am writing synonyms of hi hello and everything so i will be first of all writing hey h it does not need to be perfect, so you can be just very, very easy. And when I'm painting with my non-dominant hand, I even stop breathing for some time. So there's my hay. Two exclamation marks. Okay, so now I will be writing after hey, I'm gonna go for hello. And in small letters, there goes my H. Okay, for E, I'll be making a C. That's my E. Now it's gonna come my double L. Okay. And then, oh, so there's my hello. After hello, I'm going to place two, three dots. Uh oh, never mind. Like so. Okay, so there's the hello. Now I'm going to write uh, in this space, I'm going to write say hi. So a capital H and a small I. For the dots, you can even use a dotting tool. I'm doing it with the brushes on the go. You can fill in the spaces with the patterns you want. The patterns are... Okay, so I will be completing my kiss sign right here. Do not worry if you make any mistakes because I will show you how do I correct it. So I have written hey, hi, hello and I will be writing down hola. So hola will be starting from here. And I will be writing down unequal letters. H is big. O would be a little smaller. L up here and then a would be here i told you see i'll show you how do i correct that's my a so that's it i would write just one more high facing downwards like so in this gap, I would be making a star probably. I would make an A and then just like that. Okay, so now I'll be showing you how do I correct. I have got as you can see white acrylic paint and see after your uh, this thing, uh, the black color dries my A, I would be just putting it down a dot. So my A is now okay and also I just mixed up with the dots here so I just put in some white paint in between or you can just plane it out rather just 
cover them up and then you can just go in with your black once again and also I just mix the dot and the eye here so I will just be putting a line right in the middle like so so now I have got my high perfect a perfect and my dots that mixed up there are covered and once this white will be dry only then I will put some black dots with help of a dotting tool so with this I will be I have almost finished with the printing thing now I will be showing you how did I do this uh, pointer finger and my pinky finger I have got this some black glitter out here and what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna just take it out in my in my plate just like this I have just taken it out in my plate and over that I will be taking my top coat right here by max factor and what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna open my up my top coat I have this brush it is loaded with my top coat right like this okay and I'm gonna dip it into the glitter and just apply it onto my nail it is giving uh, a glittery effect as well as it is actually giving me a textured look onto my nail I do not have a black textured polish Okay, so now here you can see this wheel I bought from Bond Pretty Store and here is my silver star that I'm using right here. Now what you can see is that uh, you can see a little curve in the star. It is not super flat and the curve that I have created in the star is like I have I placed the star on the back of my brush. It's my simple brush. Then you keep your thumb on it and just roll it. Press it and roll it this will give your star a little bit of bend as you can see right here it will bend a little bit and with this as you can see on this nail right here the star is completely fixed to my nail it is not a little bit up or its edges are not free with this it will stay longer and now with help of this glue right here that's a sticking glue i will be placing okay guys so here are my finished nails and actually i am loving these nails these are looking so super gorgeous this pattern that i have done freehand on my nails do come in a stamping plate and you can stamp over but this is freehand painting and i'm loving my pointer and pinky finger the textured look is amazing um when i didn't had a textured polish so i hope you like it pictures will be everywhere as usual on my page as well as on my blog hope you subscribe to my channel and you try it out and show it to me on my facebook page thanks for watching bye